devastating news now for dozens of nurses in the Bronx just as they were getting ready to graduate from a special program. Their school's accreditation was yanked. CBS 2's Allie Bauman has more now from the Bedford Park section of the Bronx. That's been devastating to, to each and every one of us. JD Vasquez and Amina Emanuel are critical care nurses at Montefiore Medical Center in the Bronx. I work full time, and on top of that, we completed over 500 hours of clinical time with direct patient care. While working at the hospital for the past three years, they've also been working towards master's degrees at the Lehman College Family Nurse Practitioner, or FNP, program. Family nurse practitioners can assess, they can diagnose patients, they can prescribe. At the end of November, Lehman College emailed all 200 students in the FNP school, informing them its accreditation has been withdrawn by the National Commission on Collegiate Nursing Education because last year's exam pass rate fell below the required 80%. The day that I read that email, I literally broke down into tears because I could not understand how they would be so cruel. They are two of 45 FNP students graduating from Lehman College this month who will not be allowed to take their certification exam. So technically, I would be graduating with a degree that I wouldn't be able to practice in. The fact that we are so close to becoming board certified FNPs in the middle of a pandemic where there's already a shortage of experienced healthcare professionals would be almost like robbing our society of, of the services that they need. A Lehman College spokesman tells us in a statement, we continue to believe a good cause extension should be granted so that our students can sit for the national exam and proceed in their new role as FNPs. All we're asking for is the opportunity to test. Lehman College says its program is accredited by the state, so they're asking a different certifying organization if that could be enough to qualify students to still sit for the exam. College administrators hope to get that answer next week. From the Bedford Park section of the Bronx, Allie Bauman, CBS 2 News.